Brian Fox, SportsScout.com here with Rutgers cornerback Ian Thomas. I still can't get used to saying Rutgers cornerback, mm -hmm. but that's another thing. Hey, w when you take you know what happened in Fresno and apply it toward Norfolk State, where do you get better? What, what's your areas of concentration? Um, well, we have a lot of um, places to get better. You know, uh, after watching the Fresno film, you know, we, we have to be more physical as uh, cornerbacks as a whole, and um, you know, just, just just play the deep ball a little better. When you say physical, in what regard? Because you guys played off of them a lot, especially when they did a three-bunch set. Where, where can you be more physical? Um, as in just shedding blockers, um, you know, uh, being a competitor and, and, and just getting the uh, wide out off you. This is kind of the first time you've probably been through a film session like this. Mm -hmm. Last year when you red shirt, you're really not. What is it like sitting through watching the defense give up? a lot of points and kind of going through a film session. Well, I mean, it's, it's, it's tough and fun at the same time because, you know, you see where you, where you made mistakes at and you say to yourself, I should have made that play or I could have made that play. And then it's fun because you know the next week, the uh, next Saturday, you have a chance to uh, really make a big improvement. So, you know, you, you got to take the good with the bad. How did you do when you look at the overall picture, you personally? Um, I think I had a lot of mistakes, a lot of mental errors, you know, but you know that's that's expected from 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 a kid playing in his uh, first game. So I'm just you know uh, looking forward to coming out here Saturday and, and and just playing lights out. When you talk about mental errors, what do you? I mean, are you talking about the wrong read before releasing guys inside? Not. I mean, what what kind of things are we talking? Um, releasing guys inside. You know, not, not sticking to my techniques. You know, to my fundamentals. A lot of nerves. You know, coming to play as well. So. What was that Did interception like? Um, you do comforting. You're Very uh, comforting, you know, uh, to get a pick and your first career start is, is, is big, but it's still, I still have a lot of work to do. You do know you're allowed to take a knee after the pick. I <laughs> Not at the time. <laughs> but you do know. Now. But, but now you understand yeah. that. Hey, when you, it, it seems like you come away from this really encouraged. How important is that just as far as the whole mentality of a cornerback to not be like, dang, we gave up 51, but to think, man, this is how much better we can get? It's, ve it's very important. You know, um, confidence, toughness, mental toughness is, is, is very important for a uh, cornerback because you're one-on-one -on -one a lot of times. It's, it's just you versus him. You have to have it. You have to have the uh, mindset that you can beat him. So when I say to you that you know the opponent is going to try and run those jail breaks again, what do you think you got to do better? It's a mindset. You have to you have to be able to uh, tell yourself that regardless, you're going to make this tackle. And you look at um, you talk about mental toughness. You're playing Norfolk State, mm -hmm. which is a big difference from facing Derek Carr. How do you? keep mentally sharp and not just think that the game's over before it starts? Um, a lot of film study, you know, being more comfortable than I was going out to uh, Fresno and uh, stepping on the field. A lot of uh, film study. When you talk about being more comfortable, explain what you mean because you knew that you knew what they were running, you right. knew the defense. What are you talking about comfort then? Um, you know, just, just being out there for my first time. I kind of didn't know what to expect, but I kind of did know what to expect from the film that we watched. But I was still unsure and, and, and uncertain of the tempo and, and and how calls come in and, and, and how the offense and um, how the offense uh, run plays and things. So just having that from the first game, um, I'm just more sure now. Makes sense. Yeah, thanks for the time. Thank you.